Welcome back, Burnout Teachers. Today, I'm honored to be with a fellow educator here. Thank you. Okay. I, my name is Ken Giles, and I am a music, music teacher. I was in the D.C. public schools for about nine years, and I've been at D.C. Youth Orchestra for about 20 years. The main thing I'm interested in in my music education is to help students understand the connection between music and history. Because if you look back over all the social movements of the last 150 years, everything has had a musical background. I think when students understand the history that goes with the music, it brings it alive and they understand how important music can be in understanding our, our uh, society. If you miss me at the back of the bus, you can't find me nowhere. Oh, come on up to the front of the bus. I'll be riding up there. that about? It's about Rosa Parks. Yeah. And every verse, they would make up verses about whatever they were doing in the Civil Rights Movement. Mm -hmm. One of the verses was, if you miss me in the Mississippi River, you can't find me nowhere. Come on over to the public pool. I'll be swimming over there. Oh. Because public pools were segregated. Mm -hmm. But they, so each verse kind of tells about another step in the effort to have equality. Wow, that's beautiful. We shall overcome. We shall overcome someday. We shall overcome someday. Take a Cesar Chavez and Dolores Huerta in the United Farm Workers Union at all their demonstrations. Wow. And whenever they got together because all the Mexican farm workers knew that song. Have you touched on like international genres as well um, for students that you may have who are from other countries? I, I can, uh, I don't speak Spanish, but I can sing in Spanish. Oh, so nice. I have some Spanish language songs. Okay. I've used the uh, South African anthem uh, in Kosi Sikilele, Africa, yeah. which was the theme song of the ANC yeah. Uh, during apartheid times. Mm -hmm. Now it's the national anthem of free South Africa. You're right that music and art and some of the non-traditional academics are being taken out. Mm -hmm. um, music is and art and other uh, like languages are just very important to have in the curriculum mm -hmm. because every student needs to be well-rounded and, and exposed to a whole variety of curriculum. Mm -hmm. If we would work on content that touches people's lives mm -hmm. and that has something um, oh, that they're interested in, I think we would make more progress in, the, mm -hmm. in improving the schools. We shall